Zelda. Praise the Lord, thank you, genius. Operation Project English. Command the chief of flight staff. Check the aircraft, glide like the frisbee. Digi to Disney to check for in oneself for spill loveliness. You break the mirror that remind you of your ugliness. So when I bust, no one is in touch. Some returning with the mic clutch, like such. Who plan but never execute? He had the eat in his hand, but yo, he did. Therefore, your mechanism of material better be sickly or let your L. What's up everybody, welcome to Glass Can Bottle Beer Reviews. What we got tonight, or today, I'm really excited about is Epiphany from Foundation Brewing Company. Um, shout out to my buddy, No Hype, hooked me up with this one. Uh, I still, we had a pretty big, he hooked me up with a pretty big package not too long ago. Uh, I think this is the last one I got from him until it starts getting into these um, cellar beers. That I'm scared of. I mean, he's got a better palate than me, and he likes the the stouts and the crazy stuff. I do have. He did send me 120 minute. I'm very excited about. I've never had dogfish at 120 minute just because you can't buy it in North Carolina. It's because of ABB, ABV. So probably gonna save that one for the NFL um, uh, fantasy draft. We always bring good beer. I have to save that for that one. But um, like I said, shout out my buddy No Hype. Appreciate it, my friend. Uh, this is Epiphany, like I said, Foundation Brewing Company, and Foundation is out of uh, Maine, yep, Portland, Maine, and this is a double IPA at 8%, 85 IBUs, final gravity is 1.009, the grist, Pilsner, Pell, and Oats, uh, Hops, Cascade, Citra, Columbus, LM Mosaic, and this talks about citrus tropical fruit pine spice so we'll see what happens here i just sit in a little while so we'll give it a little roly-poly already wiped off the top for you no hype you know i had to clean the can it was kind of disappointing in your last video the uh prairie barrel age and not you still not wiping them bottles off man You're getting that metallic taste anyway yeah i mean it's definitely citrus, orange, right off the top, orange. And you get a mix of that tropical fruit. Like a green pineapple or a green mango. Definitely some pineapple going on now, mixing through there. You see the color, just a beautiful, beautiful, uh, just an orange color. Nice head on it. Yeah, I've got my ribs smoking out there. I see the smoke coming up, so I'm happy about that. Um, don't get as much of that pineapple now. It is more of a, just a tropical fruit basket, some mango, got some orange going on. I don't really, maybe some of that pine they talk about, we'll see in the taste. Let's give it a taste. Wow. Man, that's a tasty beer. It's not over the top, juicy, crazy. It's just a nice blend. Uh, mouth feels pretty light. Finishes off definitely with that bitterness. beautiful hot pop dances across the tongue uh, orange tropical fruits like I said I don't really get any see. maybe some faint pineapple I think that pine is coming through and um, kind of pine and bitterness is just kind of hiding some of that fruit on the taste, but still a really wonderful beer. Uh, overall rating, I'm gonna give this thing like a 9.5. I think it's right on the edge of world class. Great beer. Appreciate it, no hype. Epiphany, Main Brewing Company. Appreciate you watching. Thank you.